It's got speed, but it's not green. It's got a unique name, but it's not safe. What is it? It's the 2023 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. And in this video, you're about to see our love-hate relationship with the car, broken down into 10 points. You won't believe the crazy price this Demon has, which we'll share at the end. So be sure to stick around. Let's jump right in. Just a few weeks ago, the 2023 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170 burst onto the scene like a bat out of hell at the Las Vegas Motor Speedway. This muscle car powerhouse is a true game changer, rewriting the rule book and leaving its competitors eating dust. You'll definitely be its first buyer if you're a drag racing enthusiast, considering it's got a monstrous V8 engine, which boasts a mind-boggling 1,025 horsepower that will have your heart racing and tires shredding. Oh, and this exclusive last call demon, as Dodge is currently accepting orders. So before you go racing for the order now button, you deserve to hear the pros and cons. The first thing to love in this bad boy is the upgraded engine. You can forget the wimpy 2.7 liter supercharger of the original Demon because the SRT Demon 170 boasts a beefy 3 liter supercharger displacement along with a massive 105 millimeter throttle body that's sure to make your heart race. And with a boost of 21.3 PSI compared to a measly 15.3 PSI in the Challenger SRT Hellcat Red Eye Widebody, this engine is an absolute beast. Speaking of beasts, let's talk horsepower. The SRT Demon 170's supercharged 6.2 liter V8 churns out a mind-boggling 1,025 horsepower in 945 pound-feet of torque on E85. That's a combo of gasoline and ethanol, folks. But even on regular old E10 gasoline, this baby still cranks out a whopping 900 horsepower in 810 pound-feet of torque. But wait, there's more. This engine is smart too. That's right, the SRT Demon 170's engine management system can detect the percentage of ethanol in the gasoline and adjust the fueling and spark timing accordingly. And if you want to unleash the full 1,025 horsepower output, you'll need to make sure the ethanol figure is above 65%. All these engine specs sound amazing to an enthusiast, but it won't be long after you take it for a spin that you'll be rushing to the nearest station. Because the first thing we hate about this car is the fuel economy. The base V6 engine 2023 Challenger gets 19 mpg in the city and 30 mpg on the highway with rear wheel drive. But if you opt for all-wheel drive, those numbers drop to 18 mpg city and 27 mpg highway. And things only get worse when you upgrade to the Hemi V8 model, with fuel economy ratings ranging from 16 mpg city and 25 mpg highway to a measly 14 mpg city and 23 mpg highway. But wait, it gets even worse. The Challenger Hellcat, which boasts a 717 horsepower engine, gets the lowest fuel economy ratings of them all, with just 13 MPG City and 22 MPG Highway. Yikes. Now, we know what you're thinking. With a powerhouse engine like the SRT Demon 170's 1,025 horsepower powertrain, you're not exactly expecting Prius-level fuel efficiency. But even compared to the 2018 Dodge SRT Demon, the 2023 model's fuel economy rating is sure to be significantly lower. So if you're looking to save on gas money, the 2023 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170 might not be the best choice for you. Moving on to the looks, which is another thing we love. It was honestly love at first sight once we saw the sporty and aggressive look of the 2023 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170. The new badge featuring a 170 neck tattoo and yellow eyes is a slick touch that represents the E85 fuel and the fender flares have been dropped to save weight. And let's talk about those colors. The 2023 Challenger SRT Demon 170 comes in 14 exterior colors, but the free options of white knuckle, pitch black, and torrid are just the tip of the iceberg. If you want to make a statement, you can go for colors like Destroyer Gray, Granite, Plum Crazy, Triple Nickel, F8 Green, B5 Blue, Frostbite, Octane Red, Cinnamon Stick, Go Mango, or Sublime. But be prepared to pay up for those options. As much as we love its variety, we hate its rarity. 
Yeah, that's right. The 2023 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170 isn't going to be a common sight on the roads because the production run is limited to just 3,300 units, which means getting your hands on one is going to be a Herculean task. The majority of these models will be sold in the US, with only 300 allocated to our friends up north in Canada. So if you're not in North America, well, tough luck. And even if you are, be prepared to jump through hoops to get this limited edition muscle car. Think of it as the automotive equivalent of fighting a needle in a haystack. Now, if you're over the fuel economy issue, because we are, then you will love the speed of this mean machine. This car boasts a mind-boggling 1,025 horsepower and can go from a standstill to 60 miles an hour in just 1.66 seconds, making it the fastest factory muscle car in the world. Yep, you read that right. It completely destroys the competition, including the Challenger SRT Superstock, which goes from 0 to 60 in a sluggish 3.25 seconds and the SRT Hellcat Red Eye, which takes 3.4 seconds to hit 60 miles an hour. But hold on to your seats because the Demon 170 isn't done yet. According to Dodge CEO Tom Kuniskis, to achieve these figures, you'll need a well-prepared drag strip. While you'll love the speed, you'll hate the cheap cabin. Picture yourself cruising down the street, the engine roaring beneath the hood. But as you look around the interior, it's hard to ignore the feeling that something is missing. That's because, unfortunately, the Challenger SRT Demon 170's cabin doesn't quite live up to the hype. While the outside of the car looks sleek and modern, the interior feels a bit outdated and dull. While lower trims of the Challenger have already been criticized for their low rent feel, even the Demon 170 doesn't quite match up to the expectations that come with the vehicle of this caliber. The Spartan cabin is stripped down to the basics, with just a fabric-covered driver's seat and no passenger chair or rear bench. And if you're the type of person who likes a bit of carpeting in your trunk, well, tough luck as the Demon 170 model loses that too. If you're someone who likes to talk on and on about this ride at We Are, then you'll love the car's unique nameplate. The fascinating backstory behind the 2023 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170's nameplate is that the 170 extension is not just a random number, but a nod to the E85 ethanol fuel that powers the car, which is an impressive 170 proof. It's a clever way to pay homage to the car's remarkable power source and give it a distinctive name that sets it apart from the rest of the Challenger lineup. But that's not all. The 170 name also holds another secret. It's a nod to the Dodge Direct Connection Helifant C170 crate engine, which shares some of its internal components with the SRT Demon's supercharged 6.2 liter V8 power plant. It's clear that Dodge has put a lot of thought and attention to detail into the Demon 170's nameplate, making it not just a muscle car, but a piece of automotive art. But while you're telling this story to your buddy in the passenger seat, Keep your eyes and ears on the road, because another thing we hate about it is the minimal standard safety technology. Don't get us wrong, the rear view camera is nice, but shouldn't a car that can go from 0 to 60 in under 2 seconds have a few more features to keep you safe? Unfortunately, it seems like Dodge has thrown caution to the wind when it comes to driver assist technology. Want forward collision warning, blind spot monitoring, rear parking sensors, or rain sensing windshield wipers? Better add those as options, but fear not drag racing aficionados, for the 2023 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170 comes equipped with the best racing accessories money can buy, including a carbon fiber rear seat delete panel harness bar, and yes, even a parachute. So hit the gas and hold on tight. Just don't forget to buckle up, literally. The last thing we love about this beast is its excellent performance. With an 8-speed automatic transmission and an engine that roars like a lion, this car is a true performer. There's also a Transbrake 2.0 feature that allows you to launch your Demon 170 with a simple pull of a paddle, giving you maximum power at the drag strip. And with a customizable torque output, you'll be able to tailor the driving experience to suit your needs. 
Then we have the tires on this demon, which are 315, 50R17, Mickey Thompson ET Street R Drags radial in the rear, and 245, 55 R18 in the front, providing unbeatable grip for those high speed sprints. And if you're worrying about traction in less than ideal weather, don't fret. There's an optional wheel and tire package that'll give you the added security you need. Dodge has also managed to save weight with a set of wheels that mix forged aluminum and carbon fiber, saving you up to 20.12 pounds in the front and 11.98 pounds compared to the Dodge Challenger SRT Hellcat Red Eye Widebody. And with a softer ride quality thanks to the adaptive Bilstein shocks and softer springs and sway bars, you'll feel like you're gliding over the road. Considering all things to love, this last thing to hate can possibly be a deal breaker the price. This muscle car will cost you a whopping $96,666, and that's before you even factor in the $1,595 destination fee and a $2,100 gas guzzler charge. Sure, the Demon 170 comes with some cool features like forged aluminum wheels, but if you want to go all out, be prepared to shell out some serious cash. The carbon fiber and aluminum two-piece wheels alone will set you back a staggering $11,495. Want to take a friend or two along for the ride? That'll cost you an extra $1,995 for the passenger chair and rear bench seat. And if you're the kind of driver who likes the finer things in life, you might want to add the Alcantara and Laguna leather interior option, which will set you back $5,995. But wait, there's more. For those who want to add some style to their ride, there's a variety of interior options including a sunroof for $9,995, GPS navigation for $995, a trunk dress kit for $295, and demonic red seatbelts for $395. So, if you want to go all out and get the full Demon 170 experience, it'll set you back a whopping $133,421. That's a hefty price tag for any car, and it probably turns away many of the normal drivers. But then again, this car was made for true speed enthusiasts like you. Just be careful when you head to the dealership, because rumor has it that some dealers are charging around $100,000 in markup. Overall, you have the choice of loving this car for its excellent performance, upgraded engine, unique nameplate, and speed. Or you can hate it for its fuel economy, low quality cabin, limited stock, and hefty price. Let us know if these points are a deal breaker for you or not. And thanks for watching.